guys, this is Paul with Vixen Tactical and Mobile. Uh, we're going to walk you through this uh, little 380EZ Cerakote project today. This is for our partners down at SRT Mobile. Uh, we're going to do uh, a new color, which is uh, Northern Lights. It's a uh, blue-green uh, metallic. has a little color shift to it. Uh, so we're going to be doing the slide and the base plate today. Uh, we're going to just walk you through... Uh, just the uh, basics on this. Um, this one's already been soaked in acetone overnight, uh, just like we do all metal parts. And then we're going to uh, media blast it and gas this out in the oven, uh, which removes any impurities, uh, any oils. It'll bring all that to the surface. Um, if it needs to be uh, re-soaked, we'll do that. Uh, but uh, most of the time, uh, we do a pretty good job of uh, stripping all the oil and uh, any grease or uh, any contaminants off of these parts with the initial cleaning and the uh, soaking. So I don't anticipate that happening today. So I think uh, we'll be able to walk right through this one. Um, and we do disassemble everything. Again, this one's just going to be on the slide. Uh, quick note on these EZs. It is an internal hammer. And there's your block. It's held in by one pin. And... Uh, it can be a little bit tricky to get this back inside uh, and you have to be really careful on your film thickness on the inside of these slides. Um, some companies I've, I've noticed they don't do the internal slides at all but for one single color application I uh, haven't had any issues with that. So uh, here we go. Stay with us. Thanks. Alright guys, so we came out of our uh, media blast and now we're going to uh, gas this slide out at uh, 300 degrees for an hour and uh, we should be good to go after that. Alright guys, so we're uh, degassed uh, going into the booth now and we're going to go ahead and shoot this. So let's see what we got. gonna get ready to mix this up we're gonna go with uh, 12 to 1 on the mix uh, that'll give us a little bit higher gloss uh, since it's a metallic um, so it'll have kind of a satin finish to it instead of a dull uh, finish like uh, most Cerakote colors are uh, and this is without a clear coat as well so here we go
Alright guys, so here's our uh, finished product there. Pretty cool color. It's got a lot of pearl in it. Nice metallic. Get some photos of it outside when it's uh, fully assembled. And I'll add that to the back of this uh, video. So stay tuned. Okay guys, here's uh, our 380 EZ. This is the Northern Lights. Pretty cool color. It's uh, green with gold pearl in the coat. Uh, and it's uh, just a solid spray. No clear, no extra steps. This is a really nice color. So we're going to put this guy back together and then show you the finished and final product. Thanks. All right, guys, here we go. Here's the EZ back together. And we're going to get uh, a couple photos outside for the uh, finale on this. Uh, Got to put the uh, mag back together with that base plate. But uh, there you go. Pretty cool color. Uh, it is uh, greenish with a gold tone in the light. Uh, so this ought to look pretty good outside. So, yeah, I'm a fan. New color. And uh, stay tuned. Got a couple of uh, reviews coming soon with the uh, Olight Seeker 2 and the Mini Valkyrie over there. And uh, those lights I'm using exclusively on the uh, Mark 1 builds, the carbines and rifle uh, precision carbines. So uh, stay tuned. That's going to be in the future and we'll do uh, a couple of builds with um, the lights set up on those so that's it right there I'll get this uh, complete with the base plate and uh, do some snapshots that's it thanks for watching